What's up YouTube, this is the best and today I'm going to show you how I tame the hog rider and how you can do it fairly easily or at least how you can simplify the process of taming the hog rider. So first of all, it's kind of annoying. Getting to the hog rider is easy. It's easy to get them. You can get them almost right away or if you don't get them, you can jump on an alligator. But the alligators are quite annoying and avoiding them is a pain to be honest. So what I did is I just played around. I didn't really care about getting the hog rider. All I tried to do was avoid the, figure out how to avoid the alligators. And what I found out, the toughest part of it for me was when there are, there's two parts of the, uh, there's a water on the right, water on the left, and you have to run down the middle. And there's two alligators coming at you from both sides at the same time. Um, so there's two coming, uh, two coming from the right, two coming from the left, and they do it simultaneously. And avoiding those was, was the hardest for me. So what I did is if you run straight in the middle, you're going to die. What I did was run on the left or run closer to one side and then do a quick zigzag pattern. And then you barely avoid getting eaten by both of the alligators. That's the only surefire way I found of avoiding them. And then at the end, the um, boar will start buckling a little bit and bucking a little bit. And it's, it's kind of annoying because he does get faster, which makes it easier to avoid the alligator, some of the alligators. But then again, he's harder to control. So there's really no way to, you know, improve that part of it except for practice and just playing around. But other than that, he's, he's fairly annoying to catch, but he looks quite cool. So there's that. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the video, subscribe, like. Thank you very much.